This question was asked in Delhi I, uh, CBSE 2011 for three marks. We'll discuss this question. It's very important question. What are the questions saying? A ray of light is incident on a glass prism. Trace the path of the ray and derive an expression for a plus delta is equal to i plus e. So I hope you have got the question. Now we'll do the solution of this. So this is the glass prism. A ray of light is incident on it. Let the incident ray be named as P Q. When a ray of light goes from rarer to denser medium, it will bend. That will is getting refracted. And from denser to rarer medium, it will bend away from the normal. And this ray is termed as the emergent ray. The angle with the normal is angle of incidence. This angle with the normal is angle of emergence. These are the two angle of refractions of the first face and then the second face. We know that this incident ray went straight. This emergent ray bended this much, so it has bended this much, and this angle is termed as angle of deviation. That is delta. Can I say this angle? Let it be delta one, and this angle let it be delta two. So if this is I. This hole will be I. Out of this, this is R one. So delta one will become I minus R one. And this hole is E. So this hole will also be E. So delta two will become E minus R two. So we know delta one is I minus R one, and delta two is E minus R two. In triangle MQR, MQR is this triangle. I can say the exterior angle is sum of two remote interior angles. The exterior is sum of two remote interior. So delta will become delta one plus delta two. But delta one from here is I minus R one, and delta two from here is E minus R two. So can I club I and E together? It will become I plus E minus R one minus R two minus R one plus R two. In triangle QNR, QNR is the lower triangle. I can say angles in a triangle add up to 180. So R1 plus R2 plus triangle QNR will become 180. This plus this plus this is 180. Third thing in a cyclic quadrilateral. Where is the cyclic quadrilateral? We can see the cyclic quadrilateral AQNR. AQ N R. What is the cyclic quadrilateral with the opposite angles add up to how much? 180. So I can say if this is the normal, okay, with this angle. So this will be 90, and this is the normal with this angle. It will be 90. So 90 plus 90 is 180. So these two angles of the cyclic quadrilateral will also add up to 180. This and this. So can I say angle A plus angle Q N R is adding up to 180? In the cyclic quadrilateral, A Q N R A plus Q N R is 180. We have got equation two and equation three. If I see equation two and equation three, 180, 180, same same. Q N R Q N R same same. So this both have to be same same. That means A will become equal to R1 plus R2. So from two and three, we know that A is equal to R1 plus R2. Okay. Now we know that A is R1 plus R2. If you look at equation number one, that is delta is I plus E minus R1 plus R2. So R1 plus R2 is A. From four, substitute in one. So delta will become I plus E minus A. So A plus delta will become I plus E. So we know from here that the angle of deviation. Beta, what is this angle of the prism? That is A. What is delta angle of deviation? By how much is the ray deviated by? कितना मुड़ गया वो? I is the angle of incidence. E is the angle of emergence. So can I say angle of deviation depends on angle of incidence? It depends on the angle of prism, and it also depends on the material of the prism. That it depends on mu. So we can say delta depends on I, delta depends on A, and delta also depends on the material of the prism. Now we can see this question is for three marks. So how will be the splitting up of marks? The diagram will fetch you one mark if you draw the diagram properly, like this. You will get one mark. Okay. 
क्वेश्चन इक्वेशन नंबर वन विल फेच यू हाफ मार्क इक्वेशन नंबर टू एंड थ्री विल फेच यू हाफ मार्क इक्वेशन नंबर फोर विल फेच यू हाफ मार्क and the main equation which is asked that is a plus delta is equal to i plus e which you write from here will fetch you half mark so it will become 1 plus 1 plus 1 that is how many marks 3 marks so if this comes in the examination if you write it this way you will get whole 3 marks